Tommy, congratulations on your award tonight. Thank you. Um, hugely well deserved. Um, and you were saying earlier on just how much it meant to you that this award has been presented by BAFTA Scotland in your home country. It means a lot to me. I'm sure a lot of people in Scotland are very proud of the work that you're doing mm -hmm. because, you know, Scots, they love to see people doing well, especially all around the world. Yes, you're a it perfect does. example of that. Oh, I think. thank you for that. I do my best. You're working on some fantastic projects, aren't you? I am doing some good ones. I just finished doing Star Wars, which I'm very excited about. I'm sure one or two other people as well are quite interested. <laughs> you in wait another story. year to see it, which is the only hard bit. Uh -huh. And uh, so it was a wonderful project. They're yeah. they're a super hyper paranoid secret. So uh, so it's a hard one because I want to see it. It's going to be a great film. I think you'll I think you'll all like. It. I hope you do. I'd There'll be a lot of people let down if, it, if it's not a good film. There'll be a lot of disappointed people. Well, it's probably going to be the the biggest film for quite some time when it is released. Well, we'll have got something wrong, I think, if it isn't a success. Yeah. But it, it, it's, it's something, JJ has made something very special. It's gone back to the roots of the original Star Wars movies, and he is just, he's done something incredibly special. It's really rich, and it, it's fresh, and yet it pays homage to the, to the original films. It's something really special. And I don't doubt that, because I've seen the other films that you've worked on, mm -hmm. and I've seen the other films that JJ Abrams worked on. And he, I mean, he, he's done tremendous work in previous films, I know that you worked on you worked on uh, Star. I've done all of JJ's films. Yeah, I've done all of JJ's. So yes, I mean, uh, it's mm. quite a partnership. Is it fair to say that you're his right hand man? I I wouldn't ever presume that, but certainly we're also good friends, and I'm very lucky to have him as a buddy. Oh. Uh, yeah, I'm his. I, I, I hope I'm his right hand man on a film set. Yes, mm -hmm. it's a big. I've done a lot. I've done. I started doing the tiniest low budget Ken Loach movies, and mm -hmm. I came from an art, art house background, so it's quite bizarre that I'm now the guy uh -huh. who does the big blockbusters. But uh, Star Wars is is. It's big. It's bigger than I've ever done. And I've done some big movies like Twenty Twelve, or you know, or the or the Mission Impossible films. If, in terms of a scale of ambition, I've never done anything which is bigger than that. Oh. And I think my dad did the first VCR in Scotland. He was a movie obsessive, so my 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 childhood was sitting watching old classic movies with my dad, and that's where I learned a love of film. That and was my my upbringing. Did you get the chance to tell Harrison Ford that story? Because I was. I did tell Harrison Ford, yeah, and yeah, Harrison Ford is an amazing man. So oh. I, I to work with him was. To work with Han Solo and Indiana Jones is a, obviously a great privilege. I've been very lucky. And the guys like that, Harrison Ford, Tom Cruise, all those guys at the, at the biggest of the stars, invariably, they don't get it without having massive talent and being great people. Uh -huh. And they're two examples of two wonderful guys to work with. Well, Tommy, uh, mm. congratulations again. Awesome. And, Thank and you. And a pleasure to chat to you. And I hope to see lots and <laughs> lots more of these fantastic films that you're making. Well, thank you so much. A, a great pleasure. Thank you.